Here's another fun use of the 254E to um, get different pitches out of the same sequence. I have a simple monophonic sequence coming out of the top section of the 251 and the original signal of that goes to the modulation oscillator in audio frequency of the 259 and it sounds like this. And then I'm taking a second feed and going to the top section of the 254E and taking that feed and going to the principal oscillator of the 259 and changing its voltage so I get parallel chords. And then I'm taking that output of the 254 top section going into the B section and taking that and going over to 261E and getting yet a third layer. Okay. Here's a variation on the previous patch. I'm going to do some feeding back of CVs within the 254E. Right now it's basically that same patch. Here's the original sequence monophonic and it's being sent like in the other patch to the 254 so I can get some more uh, harmonies, if you will. Except this time I'm uh, pinging this. And now I can break that up a little bit by sending the same original pulses coming from the 251 and going to the 281. Bring it down to the 266. Take uh, quantized random voltages out and go to the second section of the 254 right into the select and then I can take that select out of B and go into the select uh, take, take the output of B and go into select of A which has a different uh, CV going into side 2. So we've got a variety of sounds coming out of just that first simple sequence. And here's a quick and easy variation. I just sort of krellized the uh, CV that's going into uh, the second half of the A section of the 254E. So now it's doing some weird things to get even more variety out of our original uh, sequence. <laughs> Okay, I'm using three different envelopes here. They're not synchronized. Uh, this one, of course, is the main one. That's just pumping out an articulation. And that's going down to here. The second one is going to B, so A and B, and then C is a slow triangle and what's happening is it's sort of like adding slowly adding and taking away the uh, sort of effect
Love this, going straight to ping in the 292. I've got a lot of stuff going just into the 261. Um, so we're, you know, using this A section to blend between two different uh, CVs, and I'm using pulses everywhere else. I'm taking this A section, going to the B section, messing it up some more, and sending it to the uh, symmetry and the A section is going to timbre and then I'm taking that further and using that to trigger stuff yep, up here and then finally morphing that and blending between that uh, this and another CV and sending that to the LFO so um, not a great patch but um, as far as sound, but it sure is fun to get all this stuff going with just a 261. And I'll send you an audio file. That's left channel and right channel. 